Hello everyone, it's Pierre and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to talk about why Pimafix and Melafix are just not useful aquarium remedies and what you should use instead. Pimafix and Melafix are two products from API that claim to treat various fungal and bacterial infections in fish. They're made from tea tree oil and bay oil and are touted as safe and gentle for your fish and plants. However, many aquarists have reported that these products don't work as advertised and may even cause more harm than good. One of the main problems with Pimafix and Melafix is that they're not specifically targeted to kill the pathogens that cause fish disease. This means that the infection can sometimes persist or even worsen and spread to other fish in the tank. A 2015 study from the North Carolina State University showed that Melafix had no significant bactericidal or inhibitory effect on any of the pathogens they tested. Another problem with Pimafix and Melafix is that they can reduce the oxygen levels in the water which can stress your fish and make them more susceptible to disease. These products create a thin film on the surface of the water, which prevents gas exchange and oxygen diffusion. They can also interfere with the biological filtration process, which is essential for maintaining a healthy aquarium. Some fish, especially those with labyrinth organs, such as bettas and gouramis, may even have difficulty breathing and suffocate if exposed to these products. So what should you use instead of Pimafix and Melafix? Well, the best way to prevent and treat infections in your fish is to keep your water quality high and your fish stress-free. This means doing your water changes as necessary, avoiding overstocking and overfeeding, making sure that your aquarium is cycled before adding fish and providing adequate filtration and aeration for them. Fish have immune systems which have evolved to handle most diseases given enough time. In fact, the reason some people swear by many of these natural treatments is because the fish would have gotten better anyway, even if nothing at all was done. If your fish do get sick or look sick, you should use the proper medication that is designed for that specific type of infection. How do you know what kind of infection your fish has? Well, there's multiple sources out there. I recommend going to a source that isn't trying to sell you anything. I'm linking a great website called Aquarium Science in the description below that can help you with a lot of your questions regarding um, uh, keeping fish, including helping you potentially diagnosing and figuring out what's wrong with your fish. And again, it's not a website that has advertising nor does the website owner try to sell you anything. I use this website myself many times. Remember, Pimafix and Melafix are fairly useless and you should honestly avoid using them and save your money. They're made from cheap to produce leaf oils and are sold at a high markup in pet stores to unfortunately unwitting and concerned fish keepers who just want their fish to get better. Like I said, most of the time fish get sick because of poor fish keeping practices. That has happened to me many times uh, through the years. I've made many mistakes. I've tried Pimafix and Melafix, obviously I bought them. As time went on, I learned that they really just don't help. If someone recommends a treatment to you, or anything else for that matter, always check to see if there's a profit motive behind it. That's all for today's video. I hope you found it helpful and informative, and if you did, please give us a like and subscribe to my channel for more content. I'm also happy to answer any questions you may have, so feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching, happy fish keeping, and I'll see you in the next one.